guys thanks for tuning in to being black blue and true i'm pure pressure and this is another episode of what is that black girl eating <laughs> today i am going to take you guys through the steps of preparing your very own chicago style italian beef yes dipped with hot peppers so stay tuned it's gonna be messy delicious nutritional yeast, two cups, vital wheat gluten, two tablespoons of basil, two tablespoons of oregano. Just dump it on in there. One tablespoon of thyme. Of course I'm going to add one tablespoon of turmeric, one tablespoon of rosemary, one tablespoon paprika, one tablespoon salt, one tablespoon of black pepper, one tablespoon of tomato paste. Also, I use beef bouillon cubes, gluten free, lactose free, no animal content. I use this to make my beef vegetable broth, and I'm gonna add one cup. A fourth cup of soy sauce, two tablespoons olive oil. Add a pinch of apple cider vinegar just a little bit I don't even measure it out just a little bit to give it a twang after you have rolled your log up just go ahead and add it to your au jus and let this cook for about an hour or just like this you can also cover it with the lid I actually stuck mine in the oven for about 30 minutes. All right guys, let's go ahead and cut into it. This is one of my sharpest knives, so it's actually a fillet hunting knife that I picked up because I wanted to just cut really thin pieces of stuff. And you never know when you might have to fillet a fool. <laughs> I kid. Violent free, the way to be. Once you are done cutting or slicing your loaf, the trick to a delicious and authentic Chicago Italian beef is dipping. Not just dipping the meat, but dipping the bread also. So, I'm going to go ahead and open it and dip half of it in the juice. Now I'm going to add some mayo straight from the jar. Also, I didn't dip the entire roll because I do want to be able to hold it. Be sure to check out all the proportions and complete details of this recipe on my blog at Kitty Whip right there below, as you can see. Take a strip of your meat, dip it if you like, leave it how it is if you want. I'm going to go ahead and dip mine in the au jus sauce that I've made which is really just the beef broth and just start loading your bread with the cuts of seitan strips so that it looks like a delicious Italian beef add the pepperoncini if you like which I do you guys you guys to know that I do. As well, go ahead and add your jardinier peppers. Usually this would come with cheese or you can add cheese to it, but as you guys know, I am doing five cheeseless dishes. Okay guys, there you have it, your Chicago style Italian beef. 
simple and easy peasy. So it's time to taste this, baby. Here we go. Oh, it's so large and messy. I don't even have the words. Just absolutely. The best. All right, guys. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in to Being Black, Blue, and True. I'm Peer Pressure. Try this recipe and let me know what you think about Chicago-style Italian beef. Oh, also, subscribe so I will know that you are awesome, okay? And also, you'll get updates on some really cool recipes. Healthy, nutritious, fun. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you next time. Bye. Mmm.